god! Oh, they got another one! Swim! Swim, you fucker! Oh god, the boat! The boat! The boat! No, no, no! No, no, no! No, no, no! No, no, no! no. Get in the water! Oh, I just got killed by the propellers! G'day, mates, and welcome to Stormworks, a game about me rescuing people who probably would have been better off left in their original scenario. So there's a bit of a story behind why I picked this one up. It looks like your standard build blocks and make a vehicle game sort of thing. There's a lot of those out there. There's trail uh, Trailblazers, there's Besiege, all those sort of games. But it triggered something in my head, and I went, what does this remind me of? It reminds me of Air Ranger Rescue Helicopter, a PS2 game that I really want to play again and here's some of the game I'll kill this music and here's some of the original music from that game how good was that that is such a weird part of my nostalgia for this like fucking PS2 bargain bin game that was it wasn't even released in North America but it, we got it in Australia somehow it was so much fun and you'd fly all these different helicopters doing all these different missions all these different rescue missions and yeah because my dad used to fly helicopters when I was younger it was sort of like a nostalgia thing for me as a kid being like oh look this is what my dad does and, uh, and then of course Flight Sim came out with the actual Victorian police helicopter, which was hilarious. Anyway, I've just ticked sharks, let's get into this. So yes, there is a career mode and a creative mode. I'm gonna go with career because creative is really confusing. But I actually kind of respect this game in that sense, in that whilst it was confusing at first, I figured it out pretty quick. Then there's an advanced vehicles option. In creative, you put an engine down, tie it to your rotor, and you set a key that would make it go backwards and forwards. In advanced engines, you have fuel, power, clutch, gearboxes, you have fucking everything that all has to be hooked up, and you can build your own microprocessors to control a bunch of features. We are not doing advanced vehicles. <laughs> I forgot you can make a character. He's a beauty. I especially love the straps that don't actually connect to anything. Right, let's go. Oh my god, these distances. Right, so the idea of the game is generally that we're gonna have to do some missions to get more block unlocks. We can buy fuel from here, we can buy a different base, all sorts of fun stuff. However, to start with, we have to do this actual mission. And I'm completely aware of how long this is gonna take. So this is the tutorial boat. I'm gonna show you its little intricacies. There's the, uh, propeller on back, the two rudders. Uh, inside somewhere, oh, up at the front I think, there's an engine that you can connect up. Uh, and then the, uh, obviously the pilot seat with a button to start and, uh, turn off the engine. And all that lovely stuff. Now, the intricacies of this game are in the logic. There we go. As you can see, the button ties to the engine, turning it on or off. We've got the throttle, which is connected to, uh, W and S, right? And then the, uh, if we go to power, when this thing turns up and down, the rudder, sorry, the propeller turns up and down, right? Cool. And then we've obviously got the, uh, turning left and right. You can have, like, composite data, f fluid transfer... And all sorts of crazy stuff, right? It goes on and on and on. Here's how you build microprocessors. This is ridiculous. I'm not looking at it. I have no idea how it works. But what we want is like an autopilot. We want something to just automatically drive us across the ocean. So, turn the engine on, tell it to go forwards, and hey Presto, would you look at that? We're moving. I should actually be in my seat. Now if I press two, or sorry, one, it goes up, and I press four because I set the wrong button because I'm a fucking idiot, it goes down. It doesn't matter, let's just drive away and do this. But the good thing is, because we don't actually have to drive our boat, we can just sit on Oh fuck! I have made a mistake. I'm just gonna sit here and look at the beautiful sun. <laughs> Could I just hang on the ladder? Oh my god, that killed me instantly! <laughs> there it goes! There goes my hero! Alright, excuse me, I heard someone was in need of a lift. God, I can barely see your face, hang on. What? What? Is he- is he on me? Oh, oh! <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm abducting someone. So that was the time I abducted a fisherman from his village and then drove off to force him to work on an oil rig. Slavery is alive and well today. Isn't that right? <laughs> what? Oh, gee. Oh, 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 fuck. Oh, no. No. No, this is bad. This is really quite bad. Uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. I've seen the movie. Flip the boat. Flip the fucking boat. Oh, God. I need to rescue you. Get out of the water, dude. Swim. Swim, you fucker. Oh god, the boat, the boat, the boat. No, 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 Get in the water. Oh, I just got killed by the propellers. I've made a mistake. Look, don't ask me how I turned a simple delivery mission into a rescue mission, but anyway. The whole point of this boat is that it basically is a mega speedboat. It'll only work when the engines are pushing it out of the water. These things on the side are for, uh, <laughs> they're for buoyancy because it would just sink otherwise. It's got a searchlight, it's got a bunch of lights on it. It's got a bed so I can sleep. Uh, yeah, it's got like, I think, seven engines on the back. It's got two, sorry, seven uh, propellers on the back, two engines up front. This thing is ridiculous. 
There you go, there's the searchlight, and I actually control it. Oh, I can blind myself, nice. Ah! What the hell, what? Hold on, no, no, go back, there's something there. Oh my god, I got an artificial hor- wow. Nice, I'm literally finding Santa Claus's presence in the oceans and just nicking him. Like, alright, that's mine now, fuck the kid that was- Wait, what kid was receiving an artificial horizon? Are you fucking kidding me? I alt-tabbed and I fell off my fucking boat. No, 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 no! Are you fucking kidding me? How? How? How do I keep doing this? He's right fucking there! Okay, turn it down. No, yeah. I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying, please fucking eh! Oh my god! Oh I saved it! No! Okay, nice and steady now. How is my boat this terrible? Alright, I've had enough of this. You know what I'm doing? Have a guess what I'm doing. Oh my god, you're still alive! Right, come here, you little shit. You're with me. We're fucking swimming the rest of this. Let's go. 1.4 kilometers. I see the light at the end of the tunnel. You're still with- okay, oh, he looks dead. Oh, this is legit like just in the worst hurricane, like waves going on and shit. I've nearly drowned 20 times, we're almost there. How did I fuck up this badly? Oh my fucking- oh, 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 no, 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 safety, 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 that was a shark, that was a shark. Fuck, fuck, no, no, let me on the fucking <laughs> Fisherman! Fisherman, no! Oh my god, oh my god! I died of fucking falling, dammit! If you don't get what just happened there, I bounced on the boat. I'm just gonna buy this. Can I buy this island? Can I please? I can't buy it yet. I probably have to go there. I bounced on the boat, it threw me up in the air, and when I landed back down on the boat, I died of falling. How is this game making me rage this hard? Okay, believe in the dream, believe in the dream, here we go. Get on that fucking boat. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I want to die. Excuse me, excuse me, here to pick up a wounded person. I heard, I heard, I heard. Where is everyone else? You look completely fine. What are you complaining about? Alright, follow me, I guess. You know what? You're going to bed. All right. You're, you're sick. You need you need to have a little nap. Okay. Let's uh, let's reverse out of here. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, oh no, he died. I wonder why. G'day, mates, and welcome back. It is tomorrow. I've decided a few things about this game. One, I don't like, and I do like its building system. Uh, for one, it's building- it, just- just check this out real quick. I actually built all this, and I'm actually quite happy with it. For example, this thing in the back, it uses a bunch of little circuits back here to make a door go up and down, and huzzah, you've got a lovely little shut. Cool. Uh, what I don't like is stuff like this. The fucking rudders that I've got on it because your doesn't work on- uh, Right. Let's get into what I've tried to do. I went, let's build something that can do anything, so obviously, a fucking Chinook. Tandem rotor helicopter. And I actually looked this stuff up on how these work, because I vaguely knew uh, how tandem rotors themselves, I knew how a helicopter works. But uh, cyclic doesn't work, so you can't yaw with a tandem rotor helicopter, because the, the rotors don't work like rotors. Regardless, whatever, fine, it's just a limitation of the game, and I went on and on and on. And I was like, okay, finally, let's actually try and take my helicopter off now that I've done everything. And by the way, this is like six hours work. Okay, I'm touching nothing else. This helicopter is balanced, and yep! This has been happening for four fucking hours. Because I looked up how in the fuck do you do a tandem rotor in this game? Here's one of them. Okay, looks pretty cool. Would you like to see the wiring? Yeah! Alright, now let's try and take off. Okay, it's way too front heavy. And, okay. Right, so we're pulling back. Okay, we're, we're now, it's now going back heavy instead, so we're still still increasing speed. Okay. Oh, oh my god, is it actually gonna fucking- Is it actually going to fucking- What did I do differently? How have I managed to make this take off? I've already done this! I already tested this! Why are you working this time? Why are you mocking me? I don't know, it's just- mm, There's a certain jankiness to the game that I get really frustrated with when shit breaks. 
the actual, like, the most satisfying part by far was the whole, uh, door on my Chinook. The whole, uh, building a little, like, a uh, button control door. That shit worked the best. The actual physics themselves, I think KSP still got it beat. Ow. Okay, so there's a helicopter that's gone down in the ocean. Brilliant. Now, we're gonna have to fly out. Oh my fucking god. Okay, all the way over to there. Right. Let's do this. Let's show you what we've got to deal with here. So, to start with, we can close this up. We've actually got firefighting equipment as well. Uh, if we press this button here, we start shooting out a water cannon on that side. Fine, we don't really need it. Got a medical bed, in case we just wanna have a nap. Brilliant. Got some parachutes here. We've got some diving equipment, some scuba gear, some, uh, firefighting equipment. Then we've got the, uh, harness, which is going to go up and down as we need to do it, as to, uh, go rescue the people. What? What the fuck? What the fuck? Whom's the fuck? Okay, I think this is gonna be stable. Right, let's try using the harness. So, send ourselves down. Oh my god! Oh god! I <laughs> just got caught by a shark! <gasps> oh, there's two sharks! They've got the pilot! Why am I going into this? Why is this harness so slow? Ah, uh, pilot? You are right down there, buddy-o? Buddy-o, pal? Oh, God! Oh, they got another one! Oh, they got another one! Okay! Oh, shit! Oh, right! Oh, he's still alive! He's just lost a leg! Okay, right. Again, helicopter. Really not feeling the speed here. If I have to get back up in this, they fuck just did a backflip. How do I get off the harness into that? Oh no. I have made a boo boo. Maybe get in that medical bed real quick. No! Okay, well, this is gonna suck dick. Hello! Well, I suppose that's where this story ends. I can't start that helicopter. My helicopter is flying away into the sky, and uh, there's a lot of sharks around here. But before we end it all, let's show you something really quite cool. Right, so a game like this is never complete without comparing my terrible designs to... this. The workshop. Yep, this is the workshop. Welcome to... the reason why you will always, always feel inferior. Those are fucking cannons in a game about... bloody... search and rescue. This is absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god, they have drop pods. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, jeez! Oh god! Oh god! Okay, right, there's an airlock system. Thank fuck. Okay, it's actually gonna pump out the water and I'll be able to re-enter the ship. Forgot this part was underwater, to be honest. Oh, found the captain's code. Nice. Oh, yes, I am the captain now. Oh, boy. Okay, we're flying. Okay, all right, I turned on the altitude hold. That worked. Holy shit. My sweet Jesus. This is a game about search and rescue, and look what I'm flying. This is made by a guy by the name of Ghost, by the way, if you want to find it on the workshop. Holy shit. Right, let's try and, like, deploy one of the drop pods, maybe. Oh! Oh, shit. I think we're stuck. No, please let me go. Oh, my God! Hover drive on, hover drive on, hover drive on! Ah! Uh, oh, my God, it works! <laughs> it works! Holy shit, this little, like, drop pod works. Oh, that was horrifying, anyway. Uh, can I, can I get back up to the, to the, uh, forward until dawn, please? I'd, I'd like to get back in my ship. Just gonna dismount, remember where we parked, and let's go. Oh god, we lost the box. Oh wait, no, it's still on us somehow. Right, fuck it. Let's scuttle this ship. Okay, come over here, we turn the captain's key. da 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 -da. Wait, why am I going for that music? Okay, and scuttle the ship! We gotta go! We gotta go! Okay, uh, this one here, this pod's still active, right? Yes! Okay, quick, jump in. Okay, right, uh, toggle the door. Sit down in the seat. Okay, ready? Away we go! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, this is so, so cool. Oh god, this is horrifying inside of it. Oh my god! Holy shit! Well, that only scared the fuck out of me. Oh my god. Look at it. Oh my god, it's actually on fire, I think. Oh god, okay, I got, I got out. I actually I, I phased through. Oh, I was gonna say, that, uh, that does not float. Oh my god, I think this is a perfect ending. Thank you all for watching Stormworks uh, Build and Rescue. This game is nuts. I need to learn it more before I can seriously enjoy it. It's very complex, but 
there's a bit of jankiness to it too. It's weird. I like it a lot, but at the same time, just the like the little things that stop me from building a tandem rotor normally, the way you would build a tandem rotor was kinda pissing me majorly off, and then it worked, but then there was it's just, the, it's the KSP problem, but the thing this game lacks is a quick reset. You can't teleport back to your base and try it all over again. Uh, whereas in KSP you go, oh, I forgot the parachutes, quick reset, and you're like, okay, fix it up, let's do it again. Also, no speed up method, so if you fly to an objective and it takes you 30 minutes, and then you realize you forgot the fire hose, congratulations, you've wasted 30 minutes. Anyway, till next time everyone, farewell. <laughs> <laughs>